I'm Elizabeth and I'm here with Michael Murphy and um, could you just tell us a little bit about what you do? I'm the McCracken County Attorney in Paducah, Kentucky. Uh, we have a fairly large office. I've got five attorneys to work for me and about 20 staff members. So I basically run the office. And what is this conference about? This is, uh, the County Attorney's Association has two meetings a year, one in the summertime, one in the, f in the uh, wintertime. Uh, it's continuing legal education, so you stay up to date on what uh, new laws are, uh, new procedures are, and new, new assets, new technology. You also get updates on what the General Assembly is doing in Frankfurt, and things that affect us financially, uh, uh, the funding of the office. So it's a good conference to come to, and you also network with other county attorneys. Well, that sounds like you all are learning a lot and a lot to take back to better your offices. So thank you, and it was really nice to meet you. You, you bet. Yeah. Hi, my name is Allison Gibbons, and I'm here with Mel Lanehart. And so, Mel, what are you guys doing at this conference today? Well, I think one of the main things we're learning about is the AOC's new program, uh, CourtNet 2.0. Okay. And uh, it's going to be a dramatic change from what I can understand. Uh, from what the current system is, mm -hmm. and it's going to be a precursor for the uh, electronic filing system that the state is going to implement. Okay. How do you think that this is going to help you? Well, it may say, once they get all the wrinkles ironed out, you know, of course, it's going to be hectic at first, mm -hmm. but it, it, it may save a lot of time of having to, uh, instead of run down to the courthouse, mm -hmm. to look up files and documents, mm -hmm. they're right there on your desk. Oh. Yeah, that would be very it would be nice, yeah, if it works out like it's supposed to. Yes, well, thank you so much right. for your time. So what's your name? My name is Daniel Flick. And what is this all about? This is, I work for a company called Advent, and we provide several different things for county attorneys. Um, one of them is a traffic safety program, traffic safety diversion program. And we brought our traffic uh, simulator here to um, simulate impaired driving, um, texting while you're driving, things like that to help um, our roads be a little bit safer. Okay, can I give it a try? Absolutely. <laughs> You're going the wrong way. Turn around. Yep, 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 yep. Hey, whenever you go. I smell the odor of alcoholic beverage coming from the interior of the vehicle. Do you mind putting your car in park and stepping out for me, please? Well, I failed my driving test for my DUI, and now I no longer have a job, and it's on my record for 10 years, so do not drink and drive. It does bad things for you.